up until that point, we thought, oh, everything's perfect, and he's a beautiful child, and you know, surely it couldn't happen to us. But to Jace Thatcher and his parents, it did happen. And we went uh, to the emergency room, and sure enough, his blood sugar was 967. Our world came crashing down. Um, we had to get used to a new way of life. The Tatchers needed help. It was really important for me to find somebody or something or someone who knew what I was feeling. And I found that in the Diabetes Research Institute. They not only had the research end that I was looking for, but they just, they really had a staff who, who had an open heart. They were invited to tour the DRI. What also stood out is all the different angles that they're approaching to try to find a cure. You know, it's not all talk. There actually is something being, being done. And it's being done with one clear mission. We are strongly uh, convinced and committed to stay completely focused on cure research. And at the Diabetes Research Institute, there are reasons to believe the mission will be accomplished. Every single person at the DRI is here because they believe in their ability to develop something that's going to contribute to a cure. They're driven by passion and a sense of urgency only pursuing ideas with the greatest potential to help patients. We have immunologists, we have stem cell biologists, we have bioengineers, we are interacting all the time. We are trying to tackle the disease from many different angles. What makes this possible is the financial support received from passionate and committed donors, like those here at the Empire Ball. Since 1983, the New York real estate community and its affiliates have raised more than $28 million for diabetes research. My name is Peter DiCapua, and I'm chairman of the real estate division of the Diabetes Research Institute here on the campus of the University of Miami. Each year we have the Empire Ball, and I am heartened by the generosity of the real estate community each and every year in support of the Diabetes Research Institute, a fabulous institution. This year in particular, we're down here with three of our honorees, Billy Macklow, Michael Rodriguez, and Richard Laskowski. And they will be talking to you about what they've seen and the energy and advancements that the scientists at the DRI have been making. Having now had the experience of physically visiting the, the Institute, um, I'm just blown away by the depth and scope of what the Institute does, what their program is, and the path to research and the hope for a cure that they're taking upon themselves uh, here in Miami. It's, 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 truly, it's truly breathtaking and, and to a certain extent uh, almost overwhelming. I'm optimistic that a cure will come soon and the cure will come at the hands and the efforts and the minds that comprise and make up the Diabetes Research Institute. It is far better than any words anyone has told me. To, to just come here and see it and feel it and touch it and get the energy from the people that are working here. It's breathtaking, it's priceless, and you leave here knowing that not only are you doing something good in New York, but it's affecting everyone in the world. I can assure you that I am not being Mike to say this just so that everyone thinks that it's true. I'm here, I'm feeling it, it is amazing. There will be a cure, the cure will be found here, and everything that we're doing to raise money will be a huge part of it. It's just an amazing experience to witness uh, the current uh, experiments that are going on and to really um, see the enthusiasm by all of the staff here in each uh, laboratory that we visited. There's just such energy in this building by all of the staff members. You know, you don't witness in, in any institutions. Every year we come down here, I can tell you, we are that much closer to truly finding a cure for diabetes. And I know you've heard this before, we will see a cure for diabetes in our lifetime. It is clear to me and our honorees that there is a reason to believe that the Diabetes Research Institute will be the institute that finds a cure for diabetes. Once again, thank you for attending. Thank you for your generosity. We will find a cure.